Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. As we discussed earlier, the Quick Fix mode has far less features available than Full Edit mode. You'll see here as we switch that there are a lot of changes. The first thing we'll notice is over here that the Tools palette disappears and is replaced by just a handful of tools. We have the Zoom, the Hand, Magic Selection Brush, Crop, the Red Eye Removal Tool, and so forth. In addition, Several of the commands in the menu bar are grayed out and not available in Quick Fix mode. Also, if we look over to the panels here, we'll see that there are fewer choices. The panel bin contains different panels to change elements such as lighting, color, and sharpness. The panels from Full Edit mode are not even available in Quick Fix mode. Now, Quick Fix mode does give you one interesting feature called multiple viewing options. Below the main image window, you'll see a view drop down menu. That's located right here. And if you give that a click, you can choose to see your images after only, before only, or before and after comparisons, either horizontal or vertical. So we can take a look at those. And that way, as you make your changes, you can see the different viewing options. Now, you can also rotate your images using the rotate buttons that are located to the right of that. Now, to switch back to full edit mode, remember to simply click on the tab up here, use the drop down, and switch back to full edit mode. In version 7.0, you simply click on the tab. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.